to welcome back. We like to have fun here on Everyday Kentucky, but we sometimes like to get a little bit more serious. Today, we're shining a light on mental health. And so many people struggle with this subject, of course. Here to tell us more about therapy are Stephen Warner and Maureen Hyatt with the Resurgent Counseling Center. Resurgence Counseling Center. Thank you all for being here this morning. Thank you for having Thanks us. Thanks for having us. Tell a little bit, a little bit about the Resurgence Counseling Center, what it all has to offer. So Resurgence Counseling is located in both Lexington and Danville for in-person therapy. We do do telehealth all across the state of Kentucky. Uh, today is PTSD Awareness Day, so we're really highlighting that. We do offer trauma therapy. We specialize in women's mental health. Um, and Department of Veteran Affairs says about one in 16 people in America experience PTSD at some point in their life, with about 12 million on average yearly uh, living with PTSD. I'm curious because of the pandemic, you know, telehealth became, you know, the way to go. How much have you seen more people perhaps come out because maybe they didn't want to go in person? How, how many have you seen that are just coming because that's a resource now? Has that number gone up? Absolutely. So telehealth, in my opinion, has really improved um, mental health across the state of Kentucky. People that live, you know, maybe don't have transportation and those sorts of things are able to get services now. So tell me a little bit about how you're bringing people in. I know as an African-American woman, a lot of African-Americans are just kind of a little prideful and so don't want to ask for help in that sense. How are you bringing people in? Trying to just get rid of the community uh, stigma, stigma surrounding mental health. Um, so just trying to go to community events, partners with you know different people in the community, and just to kind of make it a more normalized part of, of living. Maureen, how can we get rid of the stigma? How can, how can we, it's such a difficult thing mm -hmm. because people think they're weak if they go yeah. in for a mental health issue. I think that's the biggest thing that I normalize when a client is coming to me for the first time. I really meet them where they're at and just normalize, like you are not weak whatsoever. And in fact, I tell clients all the time, I think you're one of the strongest people for coming in. So I think therapy doesn't make you weak. I think it makes you stronger. And so I'm very transparent with them about that and tell them, uh, normalizing again normalizing really that mental health is important and you should be proud of yourself for coming in and asking for help when also normalizing it I know you all as counselors how do you you know get yourself together as well because I know sometimes you struggle with things as well and you have no one to talk to yeah um, I think that's why it's really important that we also seek out our own support system um, have therapy for ourselves I know that's really important and also helps the stigma too when they know that the therapists are also seeking out help for themselves too um, and being transparent about that that it's just a part of everyday life um, just like we take care of our physical health it's important to take care of our mental health too. Now, now let's say that uh, somebody comes in for the first time just what, what's that first meeting like for people so if there's somebody out there watching right now they'll know what to expect when they come in. Yeah so for the first session um, really we we do a lot of talking about your history. Um, I really like to meet them where they are though and really normalize that it's a scary process yes but we'll really talk about just what's bringing you in today. Uh, sometimes clients really just have a topic on their mind that they really need to talk about. And I'll normalize that and say, that's okay. Just come in and we'll talk about what you need to talk about. We'll meet you where you are. But a typical intake session will look like just talking about what's really your concerns. Are you coming in for depression? Are you coming in because you just need someone to talk to? What are your goals? And just meeting them where they are. Do you have uh, other type of therapies like sand therapy or, you know, sometimes you have a therapy dog to kind of help yeah. and assist. Do you have some of those types yes, of services as well? Yes, so I actually, um, uh, I'm a trauma therapist, so I specialize in working with trauma, and one of the biggest things that we offer at Resurgence um, is EMDR therapy, which is a little different than traditional talk therapy. Um, it uses eye movements actually to reduce the intensity of the symptoms, and it's a little bit more fast-paced than traditional talk therapy. Interesting. Interesting. Uh, and, and, and people, if they want to come and, and talk to y'all, I mean, how do they do that? So the easiest way would just be go to, to go to our website, which is just resurgencecounseling.com. Uh, there's an online form there. It's really simple. They can submit it right online. They can also call us um, either way. It's a super fast process. They'll be scheduled for an intake. Uh, and as Maureen said, you know, you'll get in pretty fast um, and get the process started. And, and that's good because getting in quick is sometimes what people need. They need yes. it as fast as possible because yeah. of whatever issue they may be facing. So Absolutely. That's awesome. We, we appreciate you all being here this morning and talking about therapy and mental health issues. Thank you for having us. Thank you so much.